Hello everyone, thank you for joining Remote Sensing and GIS question and answer session series. In today's question, we'll see how we can able to add NetCDF file in ArcGIS also in QGIS. So I have downloaded NetCDF file from CHRS data portal. From here, you can able to download the NetCDF file. You can also download TIFF file and also NetCDF file, but I'm showing here how we can able to download NetCDF file and we can able to add in QGIS and ArcGIS. So if you don't know how to download, I will give link in the description box from here. You can able to watch and download this from CHRS data portal. So let's we'll go to QGIS first. Okay. And here we'll add a net CDF file. So this file is there. Okay. Dot NC file is there. So after downloading it, we have to just extract the file. Okay. And after that, we'll get the dot NC file here. So this file I'm interested to add into QGIS. So just need to go to layers then add layers and add raster layer so then we just need to click here on the browse option and here i have folder in that dot nc file is there so i'll just click on the file and just click on the open option is there so you will see we have added that file and after that just click on the add option as I'll click on the add option, you will see this file is added here. So now you can just go to properties and single pseudo colors. From here, you can select a different, different colors. What are the colors you want? And you can also want to do discrete. You can do discrete and just apply and okay. So this way you can able to add. Now we'll see how we can able to add this file in ArcGIS. So just need to go to arc map. So I will take the blank. So to add the net CDF file, we just need to go to multi-dimension tool. And in multi-dimensional tool, there is net CDF to raster. Okay, make net CDF raster layer. So here we just need to add a file location. So this is the my file location. I will just select this .nc file and just click on the open. So in your file, if there are number of variables or more, so you can select that variables. Okay. After that, just click on the okay. So this way very easily we can add that net CDF file to raster or we can make net CDF file to raster. So now you can just go to properties. Then go to symbology and here you can classify it accordingly your color ramp. Just click on apply and OK. So this way very easily we can able to add a net CDF file into ArcGIS. If you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment sections. Thank you.